And there was another bigger problem. There was supposed to be uh, a portable homing station there so we could use our radio compass and uh, arrive there and land and gas up and fly on into western China. But the fact that we arrived when we did in the middle of that big storm, there wasn't any chance of trying to make an approach into uh, one of the fields. The other thing is that that homing station was in an airplane that crashed on the way to get there, so it was not there. The other thing was that the Chinese, hearing our engines, thought it was a Japanese air raid, and they shut off all the electricity. So, uh, we were in limbo. After 13 hours in the air, and flying 2,250 miles, the right front fuel tank was showing empty. Doolittle told his crew to bail out. It was about 9.30 p.m. For me, the most uh, scared and worrisome and uh, whatever other adjective you want to use of the whole mission was standing in the airplane looking down at that black hole because we ejected the hatch and outside there was a lot of wind, rain and lightning and uh, you were going to have to go through that hole into a foreign country and then having any idea where you were or anything about it. So maybe that was the, the scariest time. After putting the B-25 on automatic pilot, Jimmy Doolittle shut both gas cocks off and left the airplane. <laughs> 